everyone, Wendy here with part two of self-massage using the Miracle Ball for the upper back, shoulders, and neck. And I will leave the link below in the description box for the Miracle Ball if you're interested in getting these for yourself. So I'm going to start with uh, two balls and I'm going to start with opening up the shoulders first. So I'm gonna place the balls at the base of my shoulder blades, right at the bottom of the, the scapula on either side of my spine here. And I'm just gonna take my arms out to the sides, palms up so my chest is nice and open. Knees bent just to relax the back here and just letting the head and neck relax, looking up towards the ceiling. So make sure that you are breathing and you're totally relaxing and letting your body weight fully sink into the balls. You'll get the most benefit if you just really allow yourself to let go here. Take some nice deep breaths. This is so great if you've been at a desk all day, at a computer, even driving in the car, and you've been hunched over this completely reverses that position and posture and gives you a much needed stretch. And I even find that I could breathe better afterwards because my chest and rib cage is uh, more loosened up. So I really actually notice a difference in the way that I can take deeper breaths. So hopefully you'll have that experience as well. Okay, from here, we're just going to take the arms down to the sides just so you have a little support of your hands and just roll yourself down a little bit. So now the balls are just a little bit higher up. And I'm gonna reach my arms up to the ceiling here and then reach them up by the ears, stretching over the balls. And then back up to the ceiling I'm going to bend the elbows like a goalpost and then open out to the sides and bring them together and open out to the sides and bring them together and reach up to the ceiling and reach the arms back towards the ears, hands to the floor if you can get them there. Then go ahead and take the hands behind the head and neck so you can support your neck. Lift the head a little bit and we're going to roll it up a little bit higher and then just push them a little closer together here. So they're basically touching. So you're at the very top of your, your trap muscle here. And we're just going to arch over, head towards the floor, chin up towards the ceiling. And breathe. Okay, and we're going to nod the head. So bring the chin down toward the chest. Keep the head weight heavy in the hands. And then we're going to lift the tail off the ground a little bit so we can roll the balls down to just about the mid back and then back up where you started. So the balls are basically on either side of the spine. You're getting a fabulous massage from the base of the neck to the middle of the back. Okay, and go ahead and take your tail back to the floor here. And we're gonna just use one ball. So we're gonna take one away and grab one, and we're gonna just place it at the base of the neck. Right where the curve of the neck is here. So you're gonna sink your head weight into it. Focus up at the ceiling and just let yourself fully relax into the ball. 
and breathe here. Okay, I'm going to hold on to the ball with my hand just so it doesn't slide out. And then I'm going to stretch either side of the neck. So I'm going to start by turning my head toward the right. And I'm stretching my my neck away from the ball here. And slowly come up back to center. Go ahead and switch hands. Hold on with the fingertips and slowly turn your head to the left. Stretching all down the side of the neck. Turn back to center. Definitely take more time with this at home or repeat this one a couple of times. Just for time's sake for the video, I'm going to keep moving along. But that's a place where you can definitely take more time. Go ahead and then move the ball up to the base of the skull here arms by the sides so your neck is nice and long and breathe here ball away. Then we're just going to finish with a little open the book stretch. So I'm going to take the knees to one side. You can have the, the uh, balls in the hands. And we're going to reach the arm up to the ceiling and then keep reaching it open toward the floor and let yourself relax. the arm back up to the ceiling and close and we'll take that on the other side reaching the arm up and open the shoulder out the ceiling and close and one more time reach it up and reach it out and bring that arm back up hopefully you feel nice and lengthened out and your chest feels more open than when you started. And we'll roll back to the back. Do a little tuck into the chest with the knees. Rock it out side to side. And rest there. Thanks for watching. I hope you feel better and we'll see you next time. Bye.